I'm Tracy Corduroy and I'm the author of The One Stop Story Shop which was illustrated by Tony Neal and is published by Little Tiger and today I'm going to tell you this story but first of all I wonder have you seen this dragon because this dragon has got lost and somebody really really wants to find him and Mr Knight is that person who really needs this dragon I have Mr Knight here and the reason that Mr Knight needs this dragon is because they always have the same story where Mr Knight takes his sword his trusty sword there it is and he goes and fights, slays the terrible dragon. It's the same story all the time. Mr. Knight loves that story. But the dragon, that big pink dragon, has gone missing. And I wonder where he is. Let's have the story. The One Stop Story Shop. you see it? Once upon a time, in a deep dark forest, a fearless knight came to slay a terrible dragon. Come out and meet your match, you great big beastie, called the knight. He swished his sword. There was no fiery roar, so he tiptoed closer and closer. Then the knight saw a note, a note from the dragon. There it is, can you see? Shall we read the note? And the note says, Dear Mr. Fearless Knight, gone on holiday for some me time. Back in two weeks, love, the terrible dragon. Botheration, boomed the knight. Gone on holiday? How am I meant to finish my adventure? With no dragon, my story is stuck. Stuck? said a neighbour, overhearing, and she led him to a shop. Can you see it? The one-stop story shop, the knight read. Wigs, wands, characters, plots and more. It sounded perfect. So in he went. Shall we go inside? Let's go inside. Mr. Shopkeeper, I'm in need of a dragon, announced the knight. The feistiest grr, one you have. Oh dear, said the shopkeeper. We've sold out of dragons, but if feisty grr, is what you're after, I have just the thing. Boys and girls, I wonder if you can think of what animals could be feisty, if not a dragon. Maybe a lion. They could be feisty, couldn't they? Can you think of some more? Maybe a tiger. I wonder what the shopkeeper comes up with. Shall we see? Shall we see what's really... the night. He's fluffy, not feisty. Let's see if we can find the ferret. Here he is. Oh, he does look a bit fluffy. He doesn't look very grrr, does he? He's fluffy, not feisty. Who ever heard of a knight slaying a ferret? Hey, I could be really feisty. 
feisty girl. The ferret beamed. Of course, night slave ferret, the shopkeeper said. You just need the right story. He checked his drawers and cupboards, crammed with tales just bursting to be told. Aha, he said. Maybe something like... The Starry Space Chase Adventure. Here, you zoom far across the galaxy. Then you slay, wait for it, the Space Ferret of Doom. Du, du, du. There he is. No, no, you nincompoop, blustered the knight. Knights don't fly spaceships, they ride gallant horses. Well, if it's horses you want, the shopkeeper said. Maybe something like... The Hold On To Your Hats Cowboy Adventure. Well, here, you'll hunt down Wild Will Ferret. Can you see him? The meanest outlaw in town. But the cowboy horse was a bonkers buckaroo. Slow down, bellowed the knight. Whoa! Can you see the horse has thrown him, but just in time. Look who saves him from landing on the cactuses. Look, can you see? It's Ferret. There we are. Well done, Ferret. He saved him. But maybe that's not the right adventure either, said the shopkeeper. Perhaps we should try my story of the month. At half price too, you're sure to enjoy the... Rumble in the Jungle Explorer Adventure includes elephants, bug spray and treasure map. Oh yes, cried the knight, brightening at once. Knights love treasure. So do ferrets, whooped ferret, off on our quest at last. But someone else was keen to sneak along too. Can you see what it is? The big green snake! Ooh, there he is. But look! Oh, isn't Mr. Knight lucky? Because look who's saving him again. It's Ferret. And the space bot from the Space Chase Adventure. And the armadillo from the Cowboy Adventure. Oh, lucky Mr. Knight to have all those helpers. Goodness, thank you, spluttered the knight. Even knights sometimes need their friends suggested Ferret. Why, yes, the knight nodded. They're friends. They rested a while and all was calm until splat. Can you see what's splatting from the tree? Oh dear, what is it? Bird poo, scowled the knight. Mr. Shopkeeper, find us a proper adventure with some water to wash off the poo suggested ferret hmm water said the shopkeeper well he opened a hatch and down they all dived to the deep dark ocean adventure why, 
this story has it all, exclaimed the knight. Uh, a mysterious cave, gallant horses and treasure galore. Can you see they've got seahorses? And where's the cave? Let's see the cave. There's the cave. And there's the treasure. Now, we just need a terrible beastie to fight. Isn't that right, Ferret? Ferret? Where's Ferret, boys and girls? Oh, look. There's Ferret. And there is a terrible beastie to fight. <gasps> Here we go. Now Mr. Knight can have his battle. Drop that ferret, commanded the knight. His moment for battle had come at last. Charge, he roared, off to save his friend. And he thought, fought long and hard until ferret was free. Hurrah, cheered Mr. Knight. We did it. Can you see? Here we are. But back came the beastie, wild with rage. Quick, called the knight. There must be something that will stop him. Ferret looked high and low. A plug. He grabbed the chain, tugged hard, and whoosh! The beast was gone. Look, there's his last tentacle glug, 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 going down the plug hole. Phew, that was an exciting adventure. What a splendid adventure, twinkled the knight. From now on, Ferret, you will always be by my side. Gosh, really? gasped Ferret. But then a voice called, Yoo-hoo! Boys and girls, can you guess who that is? That Yoo-hoo, somebody has come back. It was the dragon back early from his holiday. The weather was absolutely awful, he puffed. Shall we have our adventure then, Mr. Knight? Hmm. Do you think Mr. Knight is going to ditch Ferret? for the dragon, or do you think he's gonna stick with his ferret now? Shall we find out? No thanks, chuckled the knight. I'm done with dragons. From now on, me and ferret are off to see the world. There's a whole world of adventures just waiting for us. And off they galloped into the sunset to find their next thrilling adventure. There they are going together. Well done Mr Knight, he stuck with Ferret, good for him. And there's all the wonderful shelves in the one stop story shop. There we are. Well, boys and girls, I hope you enjoyed meeting Mr. Knight and Feisty Ferret. Yay! Take care. Bye-bye.